Last week we got second place at Starbound, even though I broke into the Candy Apple Dance Company studio at 2 a.m. and replaced the bottoms of all their jazz shoes with slices of salami. And they still beat us. There was deli meat grease all over that stage, and the judges still liked it better than our Johnny K Plus 8 tribute. Kendall, you were supposed to be pregnant with sex couplets, and instead you looked like a nine-year-old who shoved a bunch of watermelons up her shirt. Abby, that's because she was a nine-year-old with a bunch of watermelons shoved up her shirt. Jill, every day I pray that your brain grows even half the size as your cowgirl hat, because then maybe we wouldn't have so many issues. Abby. How was my little Kendall supposed to do 16 pirouettes into a front aerial with a bunch of watermelons up your shirt? Jill, I once had a student go into a coma the night before competition, and she still showed up unconscious and performed that solo weekend at Bernie's style with her mom holding her up. She was disqualified and her mom was arrested, but she showed up. No excuses. Mia, you're at the bottom of the pyramid because I ran out of popcorn during your performance. Patient Chloe. You're at the bottom of the pyramid because the acting in your duo was terrible. You were supposed to be two gay cowboys who were having an affair. Did either of you watch Fruitback Mountain like I told you to? No. Huge mistake. Mackenzie, you got first place in your solo, but that cute thing you've got going on is not going to last forever. I need to see more maturity from you. So you have a solo this week. It's entitled Ice Cream Cone. You will be playing an ice cream cone. I don't want to see any of that cutesy stuff on stage. This is a serious piece. Kendall, you were here in the pyramid because your mom didn't annoy me that much last week. Abby, I was gone most of last week getting a colonoscopy. Can your doctor do the second one just for fun? I'll pay for it, Jill, seriously. Maddie, you're at the top of the pyramid because I love you. Maddie, you have a solo this week. It's entitled Peace of Me. You will be portraying a mother whose child has leukemia and whose husband is at war. It's contemporary and the music will be performed live by Josh Groban. Chloe, you also have a solo this week. It's entitled Titties Too Big, it's hip hop, and I don't have music for it, so you're just gonna have to sing something. Abby, that is ridiculous. She's not singing. Why, Christy? Because you don't think she can do she it? She doesn't even have a song prepared. Come on, she has to know the lyrics to one song. Chloe, do you know the words to the national anthem? Great, she'll sing that. No, you know what? I'm not letting you humiliate my kid. Chloe, grab your bag, we're going. Kendall, sweetheart, tell Abby you'll do Titties Too Big. Abby, Kendall would be honored to do titties too big. Jill, do you ever stop yapping? Well, I guess Chloe's gone, but guess what? Everyone's replaceable. Everyone is replaceable. So we're moving on. The group routine this week is entitled Girls, Girls, Girls. Maddie, you'll be playing Ted Bundy. All right, moms, out of the room. Girls getting drunk for a second. Okay, Chloe, we're already behind on your solo rehearsal because of the crap your mom pulled this morning. So. Focus up, all right, take it from the top. Wait a minute, someone's knocking at the door. What did you say, Maddie? Speak up like you're in an audition. You can stick your entire fist in your mouth? Okay, come in here and show me. Chloe, go get some water, take a break. Maddie, come in here. Gianna, get the senior company to come in here. Maddie's gonna stick her whole fist in her mouth. They need to see this. Melissa, why is Maddie interrupting Chloe's solo rehearsal? Oh, I don't know, Christy. My daughters do the darndest things. Melissa, you should be going down there and telling Maddie she shouldn't be interrupting rehearsal. Okay, I will. Thank you. I'm not doing that. Okay, I went down there and I said, Maddie, get out of Chloe's rehearsal. Oh my God, Melissa, no you did not. Yes, I did, Christy. Christy, I did. Then why is Maddie still down there with her fist in her mouth? Because Christy, she's crazy. I begged her to come up here. I did, she's crazy. Melissa, you're a liar and you're making Maddie a liar. Christy, Maddie's been dead for 20 years. Okay, I'm done. Kendall, stick your fist in your mouth, sweetheart. Why does it not fit? What's wrong with you, sweetie? Abby, when is Chloe rehearsing her solo? Christy, Chloe is 10 years old. Why does she need so much help from me? I come up with the costumes, I do the music, the choreography, I talk to her. I'm tired. You know what I want to do? I just want to sit back and relax in my recliner with a Domino's pizza 